a boonie hat, or patrol hat, depending on your position on the globe. A great way to make anyone look like a cunt. But as with any other piece of armor, it's all in the stats and not the looks. Its intended purpose is to keep the sun out, or in the case of this hat comma wet weather, to keep the rain out, although it works well for both. Much like the selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors you take every day to be able to get out of bed in the morning, this too has a nice collection of off-label uses. It can be strapped to a camera on a tripod to serve as a rain canopy or a makeshift lens hood. If you're out and about and you're suddenly caught off guard by a sprawling carpet of fungi or other edibles, its chin strap allows it to be swiftly repurposed as a basket. Like in this photo from last year when I was startled by a flock of funnel chanterelles. Craterellus tubiformis is the Viet fucking Kong. When steamrolling through dense undergrowth, the brim is stiff enough that most branches and other such shit will just glance off the edge of the brim and not smack you in the face or stab you in the eye. A booniat can normally be used to filter out larger particles from water, but this one's waterproof, so... Tactical bird bath, I suppose? But what about the foliage ring? Surely that can be used for something, right? Well, not really. You could put a bunch of shit in it like you're on the goddamn Ho Chi Minh Trail, but it's not recommended. Everything will just fall out or deform the hat, making it unwearable. One thing that can be convenient, however, is to store a mosquito net up there when it's not in use. It's not likely to fall out due to its weight and it won't deform the hat. Like so. Pretend my buff is a mosquito net. When it's no longer needed, just fold it a couple of times or shove it in a backpack or a cargo pocket.